Farmers and small-scale food processors in Benue State have asked the government to improve security and invest in large-scale rice processing factories. They believe that this will enable the state share from the annual 360 billion naira rice import bill. There was also an appeal to the state government to turn around the food production mantra of the state by ensuring an all-year-round rice cultivation and establishment of food processing factories. The crowd of men and women seated here are farmers and agribusiness owners in Benue State. On another day, they will be tending to their individual farms, but there is a largesse by the federal government they are eager to reap from. Revenue, which before now had been wasted on food importation, but will soon be reinvested in their businesses. Nigeria had been reported to be spending over 360 billion naira every year importing rice. The rice comes from the Asian countries, Thailand, India, China, and the rest. That import bill, if Ben wasted, can process rice and process and market. Even if we catch in just to 50% of that, Ben will be registered. And Ben has land. The farmers are pleased with the efforts of the governor in making sure that livelihood is financially secure and hope that there will be investment in storage facilities to keep the produce fresh for investors. When you take a tour of the villages, you will see that there's been bumper harvest of a lot of produce in Benue State, ranging from rice, soya, and um, a lot of the other crops. Um, what we're expecting and hoping that will happen next is how the state will be able to absorb these products and put in their silos so that the price will be controlled and the extent, external marketers who come into the state will not mop this food away. The sole administrator of Oju local government says the farmers have nothing to fear as the governor intends to keep to his word. The executive governor doesn't only put those monies into use, he also listens and feels the pulse of the people and in that way the people have learned not just to only follow but to also see that on this path the state is headed somewhere. For the governor, there is no better time to ensure all benefit from the opportunities agriculture has in store, especially those who had lost out as a result of violent clashes that made them flee their homes. We intend to, in the next few days, a visit and dialogue with the herdsmen who uh, chase the more people away from their ancestral homes and uh, we will ensure that with the support of the security, the more people get back to their land. From all indications, it may appear that Benue State is set to regain its position as the food basket of the nation.